Flamestick Lab software offers a lot of great analysis capabilities for our customers, but there's definitely some people that would like to export the data, and we encourage you to do that for your own analysis in a third-party program. There's two ways to export data out of the Slamstick Lab. One is to use the file export option, and I'm going to just zoom in on an area of interest that I'd like to export. Go to File, Export Data, and you select whether you want to do a CSV or MATLAB file. I'm just going to do CSV, which is uh, can be read by Excel. Now this dialog is similar to the analysis ones. You have to select which channels you like and also you can specify the time range you want to be exported. The other thing that's shown in this dialog is the rolling mean removal. What this does is remove the DC bias from the accelerometers. The piezoelectric ones have a DC bias that we weren't quite able to calibrate out so this mean removal gets rid of that. But the MEMS DC response accelerometers you want that DC bias to see where the gravity vector is and get the low frequency vibration. So now I'm just going to open the data in Excel. It shows up and with the time x, y, and z axes and I'm sure everyone knows how to generate a plot but I'll just show you that the data is all there. Now the other way to export data is through the tools dialog uh, with raw data to MAT. Now what this is doing is going to be exporting, basically converting a IDE file, which is Mide's file format, into a MATLAB readable file. So you'll have completely raw data, you'll have the calibration polynomials, you'll have all sensor information in one file. The trouble with doing this approach though is you have the raw data, so you need to apply calibration. We have provided some example MATLAB scripts you can use and I encourage you to download those and try out before purchasing. Again you can in this dialog specify start and end time uh, maybe some other different things you want to do but the other nice thing about doing the raw data and MAT utility is for people that may have a lot of different recordings it can be a bit tedious to keep opening up each one and exporting it in the file export data option. Once it's all done, hit OK. The other tool is the split IDE files. Our Slamstick recorders are able to generate very large recordings when it can sample at such a high rate and have such a long battery life. You can have up to four gigabyte files which will have several billion data points. Uh, and that's obviously quite a lot of data to go through for a Slamstick lab, but even for a MATLAB or some other analysis software. So this dialog is very similar to that raw data export uh, option and this will split up IDE files into more manageable chunks. Mide is always in improving our Slamstick Lab software so I encourage you to check for updates to see if you have if there's a new version available and we also really encourage you to send us any feedback you may have. We like our current Slamstick product but we're really excited about what the future has in store for this product line. We're looking to add more sensors and add more capabilities such as condition-based monitoring and even wireless communication capabilities. So we really would love to hear from you and your thoughts on those and also your thoughts on just the current product as it stands. Hope to talk to you soon.